What's up, what's up, what's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, past two sides, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys. Just saying. Okay, so this is a Oracle card reading for Sign of Cups. This can resonate with Cups in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Lift, Seven, and Hammer to your charts. Definitely the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. Who does it? Sure. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. Thanks for all the new subscribers. And personal readings are currently closed until... Hold on. I think it's Thursday. Yeah, um, this weekend is my weekend with the kids. So, yeah, it's Thursday. Personal readings, uh, they're open Thursday. They're closed until Thursday, but they reopen on Thursday if anybody's interested. You have to text me to book, okay? Okay, yeah, so we're going to get started. This is for the sign of Capricorn. This can resonate if you have caps in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Warp, Them, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. I encourage everybody to check out their um, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Warp, Them, and Hammer, Jupiter chart signs for additional message or messages as well. Just saying. All right. We have Otter and Crow. Spirit messages share the collective. A cancer is about to win a lawsuit soon regarding a hidden camera that was placed in their Space. Settlement. A very, very, very large settlement. This is about to become very significant in a Capricorn's life. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. A cancer is about to win a very, um, I heard a settlement regarding a, um, a very large settlement, I might add. Regarding a hidden camera that was placed in their space in the past. It sounds like it hasn't happened yet, but it's upcoming. But it's a cancer. A sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Moon, Manhaven, or Jupiter, Tart, Cancer, Masculine, or Femme. It sounds like they are about to win. This. It sounds like whoever they're up against, they don't want to go to the court of law. They want to settle it out because it sounds like they were guilty. Uh, for some, you could have been the one that placed the hidden camera in their space or was connect was maybe you were on the legal team uh with this case or what have you what have you um it's coming up in your reading capricorn so for some reason one of you guys is significant to this cancer and then winning a large settlement regarding a hidden camera and their space in some type of form or fashion so you plug it in how it resonates capricorn spirit messages you have sound caps Family sorrow, lighthearted, carefree time. We have otter and crow. For some, you could be dealing with another earth side, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. If you are, they can have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, with them, and Hammer, Jupiter, Charge. She's plugging in how it resonates. Spirit messages, you have a sonic uh, Capricorn. Arrow, you are on the right path regarding some aspect of your life. I 
A pedophile is about to be jailed soon. This is about to be very good for one of you. Protect one of you. It's about to be very bad for one of you. Connections. <clears throat> okay, so pedophile is about to be jailed soon. For one, it's going to be very good for you. For one, it's going to be very bad for you. For one, um, they it's going to be bad for you because there's some kind of connection to you. So... Hopefully, you're not a pedophile, but only you know if you're a pedophile, not anybody else. But somehow, they, it sounds like they're a positive connection to you, so that's why it's going to be bad for you. For one, it's going to be good for you. Um, it sounds like they were not a positive energy in your life, Capricorn. Um, whoever this pedophile is, you have to plug the pedophile in and how they resonate. I didn't hear a sign on the pedophile, um, whoever this person is and how they apply, okay, if they apply. Number 46 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 46, um, manifesting dreams. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number. Number 46. And then we have water water energy as well with the manifesting dreams. Okay, otter. Another Taurus Capricorn Virgo is about to become very significant in Capricorn's life. For one, it is a child. For one, it is an adult family member. Okay, another Taurus Capricorn Virgo is about to become very significant in your life, Caps. For one, you guys, it's a child. For one, it is a um, family member. Um, adult family member, I'm presuming. So, one, it's a child. One, it's an adult family member. Earth sign energy. So Taurus Capricorn Virgo energy, like you, Earth sign energy. They're coming as otter energy. Um, however, whoever this person is, whether it's a child or an adult, it's another Earth sign. Going to need your help. Going to need your help is what I heard. They're going to need your help. So whoever this um, earth sign is, whether it's a child or an adult or a family member or what have you, what have you, they're going to need your help in some shape, form, or fashion. So whoever this person is and how they resonate. Um, if they're a family member, I feel they could be going through some very tough times with a family sorrow card. Um, and you also have the, you're on the right path regarding some aspect of your life so i think you helping them is going to help them out in a huge way and probably make you feel good in a positive aspect as well if you're not dark side energy and it makes you feel good to help others and not harm others you know pro A Libra lawyer is about to become very positive in a Cap one Capricorn's life. For one, a very, very negative in a Capricorn's life. A Libra lawyer is also about to become very significant in a Leo's life. Reconciliation, important information. Regarding hidden cameras of the past and information that will help them out in a huge way. This Libra lawyer knows nobody has told this person yet and they are right. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Holy crap. So Libra lawyer energy strong in here and hidden camera energy strong. We have a cancer that has a, a, apparently 
uh, filed a lawsuit regarding hidden cameras in their space. They're about to get a settlement, a large settlement at that. And then we have a legal lawyer that's either going to become positive in aspect in your life, uh, Capricorn, or negative one. This is your Libra lawyer, um, uh, Crow energy, Airside energy, Gemini Libra Aquarius energy. They're either about to become a positive aspect in your life or a negative aspect. And for some, I feel, I'm just being straight up, I feel it could regard hidden cameras. And I'm just being for real, for real. If it's not regarding hidden cameras, for whatever reason, they're about to become a positive or a negative aspect in your life there, Capricorn, okay? But we are pulling hidden camera energy in here very strong, and we're only 10 minutes in. And that's just the, tr the truth, okay? But however that resonates, uh, they're either about to become a very positive aspect of your life, a very negative one. So you have to plug yourself in where you fit with this Libra lawyer, okay? But you're also pulling in a Leo feminine, okay, and the Libra lawyer. The Libra lawyer is about to contact a Leo femme of their past. So this Libra lawyer knows this Leo feminine. They know them. Um, and they're about to contact, I heard, the, uh, I heard them, regarding some kind of information about hidden cameras of the past. And I heard it's going to benefit the Leo femme in a huge way. So there's a reason this lawyer is about to contact this person. Now, it is a person of their past. I don't know if it's a, uh, a former client, a former person they went to school with, um, uh, whoever, whoever, but it is definitely somebody of their past. I'll tell you that. It's definitely a person of their past, and it's regarding hidden cameras and information regarding hidden cameras of the past. Um, I heard it's going to go very positively for the Leo feminine. It's a Leo fem. They could have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or them in hammer, Jupiter charts. This is your uh, Libra lawyer energy. They've got the world in their hands with the information with the hidden cameras and the voyeur cameras of the past. Um, so you plug it in, how it resonates. This is about to blow the lid off of some, some shit. This is about to blow the lid off some shit. And I heard the Libra uh, lawyer knows nobody has told us Leo Fim. They know nobody has yet. But they're about to do it. And it, uh, so they've got the world in their hands. They're sitting on top of the world, this Libra lawyer. And they're about to bust this shit open, whoever they are. Okay? Capricorn. Family sorrow. A Sagittarius is about to be caught with drugs soon. injectables it's going to shock the hell out of them and it's about to be by someone they would have never expected to be caught and it will go negatively for them they are a member of your family you are about to be shocked you plug it in how resonates capricorn some kind of sagittarius energy it can be a masculine or femme sag <clears throat> They can have a Sag any aspects of their charts, whoever the Sag is. Um, but whoever you are, Caps, they are a member of your family, I've heard. And that could be the family sorrow. Um, illicit drugs. Illicit drugs. Okay, so it's some kind of illicit drugs. I heard injectables specifically. So um, some kind of injectables, illicit drugs. And I wonder what it is, is what I'm trying to say. But they inject it. They inject it up in their veins, what have you, what have you. Um, whoever they are, um, but it's some kind of illicit drug, so it's not something they're prescribed, and it's not something that helps them in a positive, helpful state manner. I heard illicit, so I wonder if it's like um, heroin or meth or um, or some kind of street drug. I mean, hell, I don't know, but um, I heard that they're going to uh, get caught by someone they never thought they would get caught by, um, whoever this person is and how they apply. Um, Caps, um, and it's not going to go well for them. So, I think it's going to make you upset. Um, I heard they're a member of your family. For some, you could be close to them. For some, maybe not. Okay, 
but it's definitely going to bring them sorrow. It's a Sag energy, and it might bring you sorrow if you're covering for them. Hopefully, you don't cover for them. If somebody's doing drugs, especially illicit street drugs or something like that, it'd be best to report them, not cover for them, because it all the truth always comes out if anybody needs to hear that. It always does. It always does. So it's not smart to cover for the, your Sag energy. I don't care if you have emotions in your heart for them or not. If they're shooting shit up into their veins, some kind of illicit injectable shit, they're not loving themselves enough to care about themselves. So somebody needs to report them so they can the police can handle it or they can get some rehab or what have you, what have you, so they can wake their ass up if anybody needs to hear that. Of course, you can take the advice or leave it, okay? Through many shocking series of chain events, there's about to be a custody change soon. For one, you want this. For one, you do not. Okay, uh, through many shocking series of chain events, there's about to be a shocking custody change soon. For one of you guys, you want this. For one, you don't. So, only you know if you want this. It could be a custody change regarding you and your children or somebody you're connected to's children and you. However, that resonates and applies, Capricorn. Um, so, it could either be regarding directly you or indirectly you is what I'm trying to say. But it's regarding um, somebody's child and children and some kind of custody uh, battle whether you're directly involved in that or indirectly involved. You have to plug it in how it resonates. I heard for some you're going to be happy about this. For some you're going to be upset. So you have to plug yourself in and which side you are. Are you going to be happy about this, not happy where you fit, okay? Um, if that resonates, okay? I think for some, after this custody, this shocking, I heard it's going to be shocking, this shocking custody switch. Um, it's regarding some kind of child custody battle, but it's, so, it's shocking. So people are not going to expect this. The ones that are going to be happy about this, I think you might go out and celebrate after um, after it happens, um, possibly. And it could be you're um, on the right path, possibly, on the happy side. Now, on the sad side, I think you're gonna. There's probably be a lot of tears, a lot of upsetness, a lot of um, um, sorrow there. You plug it in how it resonates, Capricorn. Okay. You're on the right path regarding some aspect of your life. A significant flyer is about to become very significant in your life. And a significant mailing. Scholarship. Schools. Information. A significant flyer and a significant mailing is about to become very significant in a Capricorn's life. Uh, information. Uh, what was it? Information, scholarships, and... Um, what was the other one? Information, scholarships, and something else. Um, you have to go back and check the third one. I think there was three. Information, scholarships, and something else. But whatever it is, it's positive. I'll tell you that. It's positive. You're on the right path regarding some aspect of your life. I feel for some. I heard information and scholarships, and then there was something else. So Whatever the three were, they're very positive. You have to go back and check the third one. But my point is, is I think it's regarding some y'all, some of you guys, it's regarding financial aid. Some it's regarding um, education. So it's all positive things. Whatever these things are, they're all positive. Uh, and for some, it <clears throat> relieves financial stress. So, you know, uh, that's always a good thing. That's always a positive thing when financial stress can be relieved. Always. Because... There's enough crazy crap going on in 2022, just period, point blank. Um, financial worries is one less thing we all could use not to worry about. And that's just the truth. So, 
um, whoever this is for and how this resonates. I heard information, scholarships, and something else, but all three of them were very positive. It promotes wellness, education, expanding the mind, all positive attributes that we all could use to expand and um, better our lives, okay? Only you know your story, not anybody else. You're on the right path regarding some aspect of your life. Uh, these are all positive things. So you plug it in, how it resonates, Capricorn, okay? Jug, lighthearted, carefree time. One of your abused family members is about to receive a very, 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 very large amount of money they should have received a very long time ago, years ago. This person was abused in a huge way. You know this. For one, when they receive this money, they're going to help you with many things. You're going to completely change your perspective on this person. They have been trying to help you for years, but people keep, kept blocking their money. Okay, so you plug it in, how it resonates. So whoever you are, you had an abused family member, uh, or you still have an abused family member. It can be a masculine or feminine abused family member, but somebody kept blocking their money. They kept blocking their money, and whoever you are, they really care for you. They care for you. They... Um, they truly do care for you, like, so much so they've been trying to help you financially. Not a lot of people do that. Even people that claim they care for people are not, and that's just the truth. That is the truth. Um, but however that resonates, they have been truly trying to financially help you, but other pe people kept blocking their money, so it was hard for them to help you, Capricorn, if this resonates, because other people kept blocking their money, so they couldn't exactly help you when they couldn't, wouldn't bring anything in even though they wanted to. So, but I heard soon they're about to receive a very, very, very large amount of money, a very large amount. And um, I heard they should have received it years ago. Um, and I heard after they receive it, they are going to help you financially. I heard they have been helping you financially. It just hasn't been near the way they've been wanting to. So um, I think they're going to help you, once they help you out financially from the money they should have received years ago, I think they're going to give you some and you're going to go out and have a good time or you might go out with them and have a good time. I heard you realize you have misjudged them or you're about to realize you misjudged them. How that resonates and applies, Capricorn, okay? Um, so you're on the right path regarding some aspect of your life. I think regarding your perspective change of them and for some, I think you might go out with them and have a good time. For some, you might just take the money and go out with somebody else. You plug it in, how it resonates. It might be with another earth sign or air sign or with some other sign. You plug it in how it resonates Capricorn, okay? Manifesting dreams. Creativity is about to spiral off the chart. Spiral off the chart. 
And for one, you're about to send a donation soon. You felt like you should have sent it a long time ago, and you're about to do it. This is a pretty good reading, Capricorn, if this resonates for you. I mean, I'm serious. It's a pretty good reading. So for one of you guys, your creativity is about to spiral off the chart. So, like, creative juice is about to pop, 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 baby. It reminds me of, like, a, um, a bunch of grapes and boom, 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 boom. They just, you start smashing the little, the grapes, and it starts splashing everywhere. Just saying. Creative juice is bursting. Just saying, baby. Or, like the bubble wrap. You know what I'm saying? Just saying. Um, but yeah, so, um, you're about to manifest your dreams. Creative juices are about to start bursting, so your creative juices are about to start popping, baby, like the bubble wrap. Which is a good thing, because um, that's what produces million dollar ideas, million dollar investments, um, Game-changing, life-altering place in a positive way. Um, who, if that resonates for you, that's beautiful. That's really beautiful. Um, it could be solo by yourself or with somebody. For some, if you um, come up with such, such a wonderful thing, you might need to copyright or patent it. Just saying, just saying, or trademark it, or what have you, what have you. Okay. I didn't hear specifically what it was, but you might need to. I mean, I'm just saying. So. Maybe keep that in mind, okay? Um, however that resonates, okay? Someone has strategically been keeping somebody stuck in their area. They have been doing it for many years, but through many series of chain of events, they're about to be busted, busted free. For one, you're about to help this person bust free. Very important information of the past. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So, um, if this resonates, there's somebody that was strategically kept stuck in their area. Um, it could be your area you live in or another area. You have to plug it in how it resonates, but they were trying to mess manifest their dreams. This isn't you. For, well, for some, it could be you. It could be you. For some, it could be you. For some, it could be somebody else. But somebody was strategically kept stuck, whether it was you or somebody you're connected to, in an area, strategically. It's like a group of people were strategically keeping them stuck, strategically. But... Um, but soon I heard some kind of information is about to bust, oh, uh, about to bust it open, bust a case open, bust something open, bust something open. And it's basically about to, um, help this person get unstuck in some shape, form, or fashion. So whether it's you that was intentionally kept stuck or somebody else, um, you were trying to manifest your dreams, but somebody was intentionally keeping you stuck or somebody you're connected to stuck. And it's about to bust open. You want to manifest your dreams. They want to manifest your dreams. And basically, it's about to um, bust open for them. That's really, that's sad. Like, that's like intentional entrapment. And that's just the truth. That's like intentional entrapment. And that's sad. If anybody needs to hear that. Now, for some, it could be you that was intentionally entrapped. For some, it could be somebody else. But however that resonates, that is intentional entrapment. And that is seriously unhealthy. If anybody needs to hear that. A very low vibrational lawyer is about to be jailed soon. For one, you are about to be shot. A very low vibrational lawyer is about to be uh, jailed soon. For one, you're about to be shot. Confirmation from my phone. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, some kind of low vibrational lawyer, um, mask on a femme, they're about to be jailed soon. Or for one, you are about to be shot. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, Capricorn. Spare messages you have a song.
Okay, I heard keep them both. We have high honor upright, lovers reverse, number 25 or 15, could be very significant numbers in one's life. 25 or 15 and 24, we have thief reverse. Heard take the third. 25, 15, 24, high honor upright, lovers reverse, thief reverse. A Capricorn is about to get a huge wake-up call and cut off communication with a very low vibrational lawyer. They realize this lawyer has been manipulating them in a huge way, personal communication. Okay, so I heard a Capricorn is about to get a huge wake-up call and cut off a low vibrational lawyer. Um, I heard they realize they have been manipulating them in a huge way and as some kind of personal communication. It's not... Um, it's not professional if this resonates for you. It's not professional. It is personal if this resonates and applies Capricorn. Um, I heard you realize this lawyer has been manipulating you in a huge way. And it's some kind of personal communication. It's not professional. Um, if that resonates, it applies. So I think you're about to get high honor. I think for some, this low vibrational lawyer, we have lovers reverse. I think they wanted to date you or they were trying to date you or they were trying to. Yeah, I think they were trying to date you. Or trying to talk sexually to you in some shape, form, or fashion. Because we have lovers reversed. But you're about to get high honor for cutting it off with this lawyer. So I think it's something to do with sex. Or sexting. Or romanticism. Or relationships. Or something of that nature. Just saying the same. But you're about to get high honor for cutting it off with this low vibrational lawyer. If this resonates and applies to Capricorn. Only you know your situation and story, not anybody else. Okay? And then we have thief reversed. A Capricorn was once very codependent on someone else for money in the past. Very codependent. But through many series of time events, they are about to really, really, really start coming into their own. Producing their own content, their own material. Artistic. Okay, so you plug it in, how it resonates. So if this resonates for you, Capricorn, you're very artistic and um, you were very codependent on someone in the past for um, either energy, time, or money. Um, how that resonates, it applies. But I heard soon through many series of chain events, you're about to come into your own and you are about to produce your own content, your own, whoever you are, you're very creative and you're very artistic. I'll tell you that. You're very creative and very artistic. So it could be heard content. So that could be content online or it could be content like in a book or a poem or what have you, what have you. Um, and um, some kind of creative endeavor or endeavor. So whatever that is that, you know, that could be painting, that could be drawing, that could be sketching, that could be a poem or a, a book or a cookbook or what have you, what have you, what have you, something creative. Okay. Um, but you were very codependent on other or others in the past for energy, time, or money. But you're, you're about not to be. You're about to really come into your own. You're about to create your own to produce your own money, your own creative sparks, your own creative juices. You're about to manifest your dreams without. For some, I feel you could have been dark arts on the past, in the past. And I'm just being for real. I really feel you could have been dark arts in the past. But you're about to break out of that. And you're about to manifest your dreams. If that resonates, it applies. Okay? And congrats for the one about to cut off this dirty lawyer that I think the dirty lawyer's been sexting. They're either been sexting you or they've been trying to manifest you in to look like they're the good guy and want some kind of relationship with you or marry you or something to do on the personal side or want to take you out on a date or something. But however that resonates, you're about to uh, cut them off. You're about to cut them off. So kudos to you if that resonates and applies for you. Okay. And also, too, I want to say, 
that could be you're on the right path regarding some aspect of your life. Cutting off this lawyer, whoever this is, I heard it's uh, personal. It's not professional. So, um, yeah, with the lighthearted, carefree time, I think they want to ask you out on a date. But I think you and this lawyer are on two different wavelengths. Two completely different aspects of life. Way two completely different aspects. About to do what's best for you. Okay. I heard way two completely different aspects of life. Way two completely di different aspects. You're about to do what's best for you. Yeah, I don't blame you. Um, I don't blame you, Capricorn. All right, I love you guys. Hope this helped and namaste.